from the station you count on for local news that matters. This is KARK 4 News at 5 in high definition. A digestive clinic going down a different track, focusing on a different approach to prevent gastrointestinal disease and disorders. And because Health Matters, KRK for Suzanne Bruner shows us how one doctor is using food to manage and cure the problems it caused in the first place. Walking down the grocery aisle, it's hard not to be tempted to grab an easy meal to heat up at home. But can non-fresh be damaging to your gastrointestinal tract? Dr. Minakshi Budraja says it might, and that's why after 25 years, she's changing course. I'm particularly interested in any disease that's related to food um, because it can be cured or managed just by food alone. Two years ago, she rebranded the Baptist Health Digestive Clinic as a digestive wellness center, focusing more on preventing diseases with diet and lifestyle. We do know that our food supply and the food system has changed. People are eating a lot more processed food. This is one theory for an uptick in patients diagnosed with celiac disease, an autoimmune disorder which is a reaction to the protein gluten found in certain grains. Here's another one, the way food is made. The method of preparation of our food has also changed. Another component to this team. So can you imagine it growing? Dietitian Connolly Weeks. She spends a lot of time with patients helping them understand the difference between whole foods and processed foods. You can pick up an orange and visualize that came from a tree. Um, it's hard to imagine a field of Cheez-Its or marshmallows. The duo is providing a holistic approach to the clinic through education and intervention. They offer cooking classes for patients who admit they don't know how to cook at home. That's a skill that, that has been lost over the last few generations. So this is what we actually have identified as a missing link. So the next time you visit the produce section, Dr. Budraja wants to make sure you know how to prepare and eat it. And while you're browsing other sections, it's also important to know how to read the labels. In Little Rock, I'm Suzanne Bruner. I guess you could say that's food for thought. That's right. You can check out this information here on your screen if you'd like to learn more. We always post it on our website, ArkansasMatters.com.